In this example problem, we'll balance a reaction for a chemical equation by balancing the atoms of each element on both sides. Our problem reads, the combustion of liquid C6H12O produces carbon dioxide and water vapor. Write a balanced chemical equation for the reaction. Since this is a combustion reaction, we're combining our C6H12O liquid with oxygen gas to produce carbon dioxide and water vapor. The elements we need to balance are carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. We'll start by balancing the elements that only show up in one compound on both sides, which are carbon and hydrogen. We'll balance the oxygen last because it shows up in more than one compound on both sides. Initially, we have six carbons on the left and one on the right. So if we put a 1 as a coefficient in front of C6H12O, we can put a 6 as a coefficient in front of carbon dioxide so that we have six carbons on each side. Next, we can balance hydrogen. We currently have 12 hydrogen on the left, 1 C6H12O times 12 hydrogens. And in order to get 12 hydrogens on the right, we'll need six H2Os. Now we can calculate how many oxygens we currently have on the right. We have six carbon dioxides, and each one has two oxygens. And we have six H2Os, and each H2O molecule has one oxygen. So we have a total of 18 oxygens on the right. In order to determine the coefficient for O2, we'll know that the sum of oxygen on the left has to be equal to 18. There's one C6H12O, and it contains one oxygen. And each O2 molecule contains two oxygens, times our coefficient, which will assign a value of x, and that sum has to equal 18. Solving for our coefficient, x, x is equal to 18 subtract 1, which is 17 divided by 2. So our coefficient is 17 halves. With this coefficient, we have 18 oxygens on both sides. However, we can't have fractions on our coefficients. We need whole numbers. So to eliminate the fraction, we'll multiply all of these coefficients times 2 and we'll get the coefficients 2, 17, 12, and 12. We can double check to make sure we have the same number of elements on both sides, and we'll now have 12 carbons on both sides, 24 hydrogens, and 36 oxygens. So our balanced chemical equation is 2 C6H12O liquid plus 17 O2 gas produces 12 CO2 gas plus 12 H2O gas.